lunch with Kowal. He's the fourth generation from the first family of film to make the industry his home. With his eclectic choices in films, he makes filling the legendary Kapoor shoes look so effortless. But is it really that easy? Well, let's find out from Ranveer Kapoor himself. Thank you very much for finally gracing my couch. Yes, thank you for having me. To be honest, uh, I've been really uh, scared to be on the show. Uh, because Take it I, back. Take I, it back. I, uh, it's gone. Yes, I didn't get the opportunity to come on the show. Uh, but finally... Uh, yeah, I never asked you. That never was asked, the, I yeah. never asked. You know, so finally even though you, you asked me, I'm like, I could have made it now. You know, no <laughs> one has asked me to be on a show. And I like the location that you've chosen. You know, it's like Do a, you get to do this? Like ever for real? And I don't mean promotion for promotions. No, like sit in a dhaba. You know, Kurt, to be honest, hmm. I love experiences like this. I think it only adds to my... Uh, bank as an actor when I see real people go to real places especially during the making of Rockstar we, we did all stuff like this you know uh, I don't have problems with people recognizing me or asking for my autograph or a picture because that's the least I can do I'm sitting on this couch because of them so uh, I, I love real experiences I don't get as much as I would like to I haven't traveled all over India you know um, so I miss all that so I try and do it through my movies you know through promotions and all of that so what, how has fame changed your life? I mean, even for the good or the bad, but how has it changed your life? I don't, uh, to be honest, I don't recognize fame or I don't feel fame. You know, I guess I've grown up in a film family, you know, seeing success, failure. I have a person called Mr. Raj Kapoor in my family and that's the epitome of fame, you know. So in this past year, what is your success, the best thing your success has given you? Um, what? Cool on the couch? Is definitely <laughs> climbing the charts. Yeah, yeah, I yes. like this, uh, yeah. you know, Maskabazi. Uh, you know, yeah. honestly, getting the opportunity to work with Intia Zadi, I think uh, he's a director who I really aspire to work with. And when he came and offered me a film, um, I thought, okay, okay, something must be going right. And for such a, a, you know, important role for me, I think that was something which I really felt successful at that point. You know, your character, um, Janardhan Jhakkad, is that him? Jhakkad. Jhakkad. Okay. Jakar. Huh. JJ. Let's just JJ, call him JJ. Yeah. Okay. So JJ says that he suffers from he suffers being an artist because he hasn't suffered enough in life. Do you believe that that is one of the key ingredients to being a creative person? I don't think yourself? only a creative person. I think every person. Unless you don't see the experiences in life, unless you don't go through the emotions, how will you grow? You know, you will just stagnate yourself. You'll saturate yourself. So you can't force it. Uh, life offers you such experiences. Sometimes it's happiness, sometimes it's angst, you know, anxiety, nervousness, sadness, heartbreak. Uh, just feel it. You know, if you go through a heartbreak, it's important to go through the motions, uh, cry if you have to, uh, you know, eat buckets of ice cream if you have to, uh, but feel it. Don't deny it. Don't use other people to get over it because then you're cheating life. It's as simple as that.